Look at that. Wow. That candy. It's a little bit more stars, I feel like. This is a vegan brush. This is the Sailor Magic vegan brush and it is a size 12. But because it is a vegan brush, it does have a little bit of a different sizing. So it's along the lines of a 1210. It's beautiful. I'm going to take some internal beige, which I got here ready. dry a little bit longer. I'm going to peel off base coat because I want to be able to take these off or else I will not be able to function. And then it will be a real fantasy for me. <laughs> and don't forget you guys, the promo code is July 4. Again, that promo code is July 4 and it will take 15% off your entire purchase here at yourlocatory.com. Every single item will have 15% off and that includes electronics, that includes drills, bits, gels, acrylic, one, two, three, go nails, everything, everything, everything. So we're gonna do a little bead of acrylic back here on the nail bed. And this is gonna act kind of like our base gel wood, okay? down firmly make sure it's straight not wonky beautiful so you see that lip right there that ledge we're gonna file that down and blend it out that's why I do not apply the nail all the way to the back so we can do that beautiful you guys like it is a statement how awesome is that love eternal beige not supposed to have big fireworks in Rhode Island wow We have to let it dry really well before we can file it though, so we've got to wait a little bit. I'm going to put it actually up to the light bulb, so that way the heat of the light bulb will make it dry because it is kind of cold here. We can take a moment to appreciate these phalanges. Look at that Fantasia diamond, you guys. Isn't she dope? Hi from Nashville! Well, I hope you love them. I'm 
regret file because when we're filing our credits, we need to go in with the big guns. So another little trick you can do actually to make our acrylic dry faster is you take oil, you take cotton candy cuticle oil, and you apply it over the nail, and it will actually make, make it dry faster. It causes like some strange magical chemical reaction, and it makes the nail catalyze faster. Especially me, because as you guys know, our acrylic dries based on temperature, so the hotter it is, the faster it dries, the colder it is, the slower it dries. And because I am pretty much dead, it takes forever to dry on me because I am so cold. Now we can begin the shaping of the phalanges. Since your acrylic is not completely dry, you can actually pinch it a little bit if you want to. Let's get our drill bit ready too. Is anybody gonna have any big barbecues for tomorrow? Let me know in the comments below so that way I can go to your house. That peel off base coat is no joke, as you guys can see. She came flying for me. People always ask, what is the secret to you applying full sets every single day? And the secret is our peel off base coat, which is actually not a secret. But as you can see, it leaves the nail pretty much intact underneath. We're gonna let that dry just a little bit longer. See when we go in to file that cuticle area, that line of demarcation, it just literally disappears. So when you see the nail from the side profile, it's completely blended. for the sign. As you guys know, I love a good skinny mini nail.
spelt out with the mixer bits. I'm gonna blend out that cuticle really well so that she looks really HD photoshopped. I'm going to take Smoothie, which is our coarse buffer, we're going to buff the entire surface of the phalange. Man, it sounds like we're like in a nightclub in London in 1982 with all this high energy. Turn the head upside down for about 10 to 15 seconds and this is going to let the gel self level out so that way the surface structure of the nail is really really seamless see when that light hits the nail it goes up and down it's seamless and we're gonna bake it for 30 seconds file had given what she had to give. So I already uh, poured out some squeezy gel on my play color palette. So that way I can apply my diamonds. And we're ready for the blingification. So I already poured out Miss Squeezy. She's ready to go. Put it wherever I want my diamond fantasy today. Let's go in with a unicorn, fairy stone, a crystal.
Beautiful. Hi. Beautiful. Now let's pick her for one minute inside the Dazzling Darling Lab. Look how cool it looks inside too. So shiny. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this technique of applying the 1, 2, 3, go nails with acrylic. Do you guys dig it? Do you guys think it's different? Do you guys want to see more? It's all about just showing versatility and showing all the things you can do with the 1, 2, 3, go system. I know especially some of the newer people are surprised that I even do our clicks. I'm like, what? Really? This is the beginning of time. Overkill. Actually, for encapsulation, it's really easy. I think it's actually maybe a little bit faster than doing it with gel. One thing I am uh, surprised that I have forgotten is how heavy our acrylic is compared to uh, just the one, two, three, go system. So now let's put on a little bit of cotton candy cuticle oil. Loco. That crazy chicken. And there it is, you guys. The diamonds are so gorgeous. Well, my loves, that's going to wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys have a safe and fun 4th of July. And don't forget to use that promo code JULY4 for 15% off your entire checkout at enocouture.com. I love you guys so, so much. Stay safe. And God bless America, 4th of July. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, everybody.